Welcome to another Giddy Reader video tutorial. My name is Michael. This is Peter. And today we're going to teach you how to load in your own applications to the Kobo Vox. Now, the Kobo Vox does come with a Get Jar Market. Unfortunately, it does not have a wellspring of applications. So uh, it's missing a lot of indie apps such as Aldeco, Moon Plus Reader, a lot of comic book applications such as Droid Comic Viewer, or even a lot of mainstream markets such as Sony for Android, Nook for Android, or even Kindle for Android. So what we've done is we've created our own Goody Reader app store that puts the emphasis on reading applications. So whether you're looking for comic book, e-reading, or essential applications such as Netflix, Hulu Plus, and all that, you can easily get them and install them to your Kobo Vox or other uh, e-reading tablets such as the Pan Digital Novel, uh, Velocity Micro Cruise, and so on. So we're going to walk you through step by step exactly what you have to do in order to install apps to your Kobo Vox. Very simple steps. Click on All Apps. Locate your settings. Go down to Applications. Click Yes on Unknown Sources. This allows you to install third-party apps. Now we're going to go back to the home screen. Locate your browser and type in goodyreader.com slash apps to get to our Goody Reader App Store. And exactly how it looks here is exactly how it'll look for you. Just for an example, we are going to download Netflix for Android. We have it right here on the site. Simple two-click download, locate your app, click download, and you can see it downloads just like that. Wait for it to finish, and then we'll continue from there. Once you tapped unknown sources on, you never have to do anything like that again. You can just download one app or 100 apps from our app store. Exactly. Once it's finished, click, um, click on the completed download. Click install. It should take a couple seconds to install. After it's done, simple as clicking open, let's close that, it's just a prompt for something else. And don't forget, we have a um, earlier firmware version on the Vox, so we might see a few of these errors, but in essence, uh, here you go. It gave us a, a prompt that by default when you get a lot of these units, uh, the date and time is usually off. It's as simple as clicking settings again day and time and you could also check mark uh, the automatic thing that was there so it gets the automatic from your network shouldn't be any more problems from here on out so there you go Netflix is up fully up and running side loaded from goodyreader.com slash apps so this has been a tutorial that walks you through step-by-step -step how to download apps as well as resolve common problems such as the, the date and time issue. So um, for all of your application needs, check out goodyreader.com slash apps. For goodyreader.com, my name is Michael. This is Peter. Everybody take care.